Good morning, guys. Oh, guys, what a long day. I started work at 8 o'clock this morning, uh, helping out again. And then after that, uh, at the skate park, and staying here for a while. And now I'm just clearing away um, so I can close off and get home. It's been a long day. I've been out for like, what is 9 o'clock now? So I've been out since. 7 o'clock this morning, 14 hours, that's a long time to be out and I look forward to get home uh, I went out and bought some uh, new food for um, Grace, I got some little uh, crickets here and then for Rosie I got a big cockroach, you can probably see it under there um, I think she will probably go for it because she's, I'm sure she's quite hungry so I just put some grass in there for them to have a little bit to hide in um, but yeah I'm just about to go around and shut everything down and make sure everything is alright before we go. So, lights there, switch. But it's been um, a busy day, but we did a lot. Um, tomorrow, we've got one more day with that house, and um, we are um, hopefully finishing out there tomorrow. I don't know, it all depends. It would be nice though just to get finished and done with it. It's a big job and I think it's actually too big for just two people. Oh, and some of you guys probably remember uh, the little kid here on the scooter, one of the guys that was out here named Kevin. Uh, he's the one we always say, and has a noodle, which means he's so cute. Even though he's like, like one of the most um, moaning persons I know out here. He's like complaining about everything. So funny. Um, <laughs> But he got sponsored today by something called Scoot World. I don't know if it's today, but he got sponsored by something called Scoot World, and that's really cool. So congratulations, Kevin. You're probably not watching this, but we, but still, it's cool that you got sponsored. So we got uh, one of the kids who's coming out here frequently, which is sponsored, which is nice. Um, yeah. So I hope you will be happy with that. But right now, as you know, closing off, getting ready to pop home. I'm tired. I want to have a shower, I want to sit down and edit some videos and then uh, go to bed again <laughs> and same routine as every day. That is one thing guys, I know that in life you have to do stuff, you get jobs, you have to do things to maintain uh, a life and be independent and stuff like that. But the stuff of getting up every day, every single day and doing like some of the same similar jobs every single day. I know that some people are like born into that the same as some people are just perfectly fitted to go through the whole schooling system and never have any problems with it. I have been very different from that. I have never liked school very much. I was good at all the languages like, um, sorry, I've got something in my mouth. Uh, English, German, Danish and stuff like that when we had that in school. I was good at that. Not French. I didn't like French very much. Um, I didn't find it necessary for us to use. I'd rather have Spanish, but we didn't. So um, I was good at that. Math, uh, not so good. Uh, I would say I learned math when I came out of school. Um, that's where I started learning math properly. And then um, what else? Physics and all that. It was like average. And um, the same with jobs. I am not a person who could like, I think could get used to having like a normal job. Like, every single day do this, the same thing, and go and do that, and so I, I'd get bored. I really would get bored. So that is, like, something I'm prepared not to do, definitely. But anyways, I want to go home now, and I'll uh, catch you guys later. I need to go home and feed my spiders. And again, I get attached to these bloody things here. I know they are feeding animals, but I get, like, attached to them. I heard the crickets a little bit earlier started, like... The little sound they do, and that made me think, like, oh, they're so cute. And now I feel awful feeding into a spider. And this little thing here is a hissing cockroach, and it started hissing when I uh, took it out earlier. Um, and that made me think, oh, this, this cute little thing is hissing. I was like, dang it, I get, I love animals so much, I even hate, I even love like insects, and I don't want to hurt them. <laughs> but I know the spiders need food, and I know that a cockroach. It's certainly not an endangered species, so they are alright to be used. I just hope they don't feel too much pain or anything when it happens. And the same with the uh, crickets. 
I don't, I hate knowing that animals have suffered in pain, especially dogs. Dogs are my, not just dogs, dogs like bigger animals, um, cats and horses and stuff like that. Animals like that, I really just hate when they get pain. I don't, I don't like it at all. <sighs> all right, I will, uh, I will catch you guys a little bit later and uh, yeah, I'll see you back home. Guys, time to feed Grace. I will see if she is hungry. I would imagine her be very hungry. So I'm gonna give her a cricket now and we'll see if she's gonna get it. If I can get one. There you go, look. Ooh, she wanted that. She was hungry, look. Mm, yes. She was hungry, all right. Look, she got it. She's probably walking into a cave now, look. Oh, I'm going inside to have my dinner. And <laughs> that's it. All right, now we got the large lady of the, of the family, which is Rosie. I don't know if you guys can see her, but she's sitting right down there. I, I hope that she's hungry and she would go for something. Oh, she's moving away. Come on. Big cockroach. Trying to get him down. We don't want to let go. Let go. There you go. Oh, she's like, what is this? She's not too sure about it. Oh, she's a double whopper. <laughs> it's the largest I ever feed in her. But I know she's taken bigger. Just hold on guys, Bjorn has fed her a mouse once. I wonder if she'll go for it or she's just like wondering. She's not one of those who eat right away. She normally waits till it's dark. And then she'll have a go, but sometimes we could get lucky. It's like there is some interest, isn't it? I don't know if she'll go for it yet. She normally takes it at night because I always come out in the morning and see she get it. So I'll just leave it for now, but uh, we tried. Oh well, I had a big welcome from this little madam. Man, are you singing when I come home? <laughs> you baby. <laughs> You're a little baby. But now you see Gracie is quick. Um, I don't know if she'll be continues that quick when she gets bigger and older. But she definitely is now, and it is quite impressive to see how she just charge at the food. I've seen it before, I told you once before. Basically just throw it down there, boom, she's at it. Um, so, that's an amazing thing about her. So yeah. But this cockroach thing here. <coughs> boat, Sally, that was Sally boating on that, not me. The problem with this cage again, guys, you can see here now. The cockroach is in the corner, and, and Rosie's not able to get to it. So I'm trying to like sweep it out. And now it's in the back where she either can't get to it. So this is why I need to redo the cage. I want to cover this whole cave with dirt or soil so she has more um, access. Alrighty, but uh, yeah, we tried. So good night to my little MacBook. Hi guys just past uh, midnight now and I'm just going to go and brush my teeth and have a shower. Well, I had a shower, sorry. <laughs> well, how can I forget that? I had a shower already. 
But I'm just going to brush my teeth and then set my alarm and then ready to get up tomorrow again and do some more work in that house. Uh, we need to finish the basement now and we go a little bit in the downstairs. Um, uh, at uh, the downstairs, not downstairs basement, but the ground level. Uh, yeah, so uh, when I'm getting really tired, I am like yawning my head off. <sighs> but that's why I'm going to bed now. Um, but I was pleased to see that Grace uh, took a cricket right away. Uh, Rosie still haven't taken the um, cockroach. The cockroach crawled inside her cave. So I'm a little bit like, mm, why do you have to go in there, silly thing? But uh, yeah, we'll see. Anyways, guys, I will go and brush my teeth and put my piercings back in. And I'll catch you tomorrow. So stay awesome and epic as always. And for those of you which are new to the channel, welcome aboard. And uh, yeah, I hope that you will be all right. And hopefully we'll turn back tomorrow. <laughs> and if you haven't clicked that subscribe button, please click that. And the thumbs, bu thumbs up button as well. And uh, oh, a final thing, just check out down the comment here or in the description below. I'm gonna put the uh, link so you can go and nominate me for the Gold Tube in Denmark, which is like a YouTube awards. And uh, it's for Danish people mainly, but uh, I need you guys to help me support me. So um, there's a link to tell you what to do and which categories to write Isily in. It would help me out a great deal. Maybe I'll be lucky enough to get some sort of award. That would be nice. So. All right, see you guys tomorrow. Stay awesome and happy. I love you guys. Peace. I don't like ticks. It's horrible. But no, if they want um, us to pay for Sally, it's the same as a child's game. There you go. Sally can use the seat like we can. She can use the seat as well. <laughs>